Morning, I'm Earth Doctor Reese Holter, and you're listening to EarthCast, SOS.com. Back in the news again, SeaWorld's orcas are attacking their tanks and losing their teeth. No! Oh! In nature, when apex predators like mountain lions, humans, or orcas lose their teeth, they die. Recent images on the web from SeaWorld's orcas are clearly showing these highly intelligent and sensitive mammals are in terrible trouble. They're trying to commit suicide. The images from the latest article on the dodo were taken at Loro Parquet, a loathsome dolphin prison on Spain's Canary Islands, where SeaWorld's orcas are on loan. What? As though they're pieces of chattel. These gorgeous animals are smashing and grinding their teeth to smithereens. Bloody awful and shocking. Some orcas have had their teeth drilled. What the frack? My colleagues will tell you that the condition of their teeth indicates frustration and boredom. I'm taking it to the next level. These creatures want out. Endgame. SeaWorld and all dolphinariums are not only inhumane, but amoral. The skinny, should you want to know, is that when teeth grind to a pulp, the bloodstream is quickly exposed to deadly infections which can easily take root. I'm shocked, annoyed, and urging everyone never ever to support SeaWorld or any other dolphin prison because this form of animal torture, slavery, is unacceptable. Shame on these despicable corporations for inflicting such cruelty in the name of amoral entertainment. Hashtag empty the tanks. Please support seashepherd.org.au because they're protecting our friends, the dolphins and whales. Hashtag save nature now. Hashtag love nature. Hashtag love is the solution. Earthcast SOS depends upon you, the listeners. So don't be bashful. Come on to drreese.com. D-R-R-E-E-S-C dot com. Scroll to the bottom of the page and click on the donate button. And pick yourself up any number of swell books on bees, trees, seas, wild weather, or life, the wonder of it all. Just do it. DrReese.com. I'm Earth Dr. Reese Halter, reminding you to protect our planets.